Soundex is a phonetic algorithm for indexing names by sound, as pronounced in English. The goal is for homophones to be encoded to the same representation so that they can be matched despite minor differences in spelling. The algorithm mainly encodes consonants. A vowel will not be encoded unless it is the first letter. Soundex is the most widely known of all phonetic algorithms and is often used as a synonym for phonetic algorithm. Improvements to Soundex are the basis for many modern phonetic algorithms. History Soundex was developed by Robert C. Russell and Margaret King Adele and patented in 1918 and 1922. A variation called American Soundex was used in the 1930s for a retrospective analysis of the U.S. censuses from 1890 through 1920. The Soundex code came to prominence in the 1960s when it was the subject of several articles in the Communications and Journal of the Association for Computing Machinery, and especially when described in Donald Newt's The Art of Computer Programming. The National Archives and Records Administration maintains the current rule set for the official implementation of Soundex used by the U.S. government. These encoding rules are available from NARA, upon request, in the form of General Information Leaflet 55, using the Census Soundex. American Soundex, the Soundex code for a name consists of a letter followed by three numerical digits, the letter is the first letter of the name, and the digits encode the remaining consonants. Consonants at a similar place of articulation share the same digit so, for example, the labial consonants B, F, P, and V are each encoded as the number 1. The correct value can be found as follows, retain the first letter of the name and drop all other occurrences of a, E, I, O, U, Y, H, W. Replace consonants with digits as follows, B, F, P, B A 1, C, G, J, K, Q, S, X, Z A 2, D, T A 3, L A 4, M, N A 5, R A 6. If two or more letters with the same number are adjacent in the original name, only retain the first letter. Also two letters with the same number separated by H or W are coded as a single number, whereas such letters separated by a vowel are coded twice. This rule also applies to the first letter. If you have too few letters in your word that you can't assign three numbers, append with zeros until there are three numbers. If you have more than three letters, just retain the first three numbers. Using this algorithm, both Robert and Rupert return the same string a 163 while Reuben yields a 150. Ashcraft and Ashcroft both yield a 261 and not a 226. Tim Xark yields t 522 not t 520. Vista yields p 236 not p 123. Variants a similar algorithm called reverse soundex prefixes the last letter of the name instead of the first. The Nisius algorithm was introduced by the New York State Identification and Intelligence System in 1970 as an improvement of the soundex algorithm. Nisius handles some multi-character engrams and maintains relative vowel positioning, whereas soundex does not. Deitsche Euromokotov Soundex was developed in 1985 by genealogist Gary Mokotov and later improved by genealogist Randy Deitsch because of problems they encountered while trying to apply the Russell Soundex to Jews with Germanic or Slavic surnames. Da Euro M Soundex is sometimes referred to as Jewish Soundex, or Eastern European Soundex, although the authors discourage the use of these nicknames. The Da Euro M Soundex algorithm can return as many as 32 individual phonetic encodings for a single name. Results of DM Soundex are returned in an all numeric format between 100,000 and 999,999. This algorithm is much more complex than Russell Soundex. As a response to deficiencies in the Soundex algorithm, Lawrence Phillips developed the Metaphone algorithm in 1990 for the same purpose. Phillips developed an improvement to Metaphone in 2000, which he called Double Metaphone. Double Metaphone includes a much larger encoding rule set than its predecessor, handles a subset of non-Latin characters, and returns a primary and a secondary encoding to account for different pronunciations of a single word in English. 
Philips created Metaphone 3 as a further revision in 2009 to provide a professional version that provides a much higher percentage of correct encodings for English words, non-English words familiar to Americans, and first and last names found in the United States. It also provides settings that allow more exact consonant and internal vowel matching to allow the programmer to focus the precision of matches more closely. See also, Phonetic Algorithm, Metaphone, New York State Identification and Intelligence System, Match Rating Approach. References <laughs>